started business in 1988. We're trying to set our production in somewhere around 350,000 quail per week. Um, our forecast uh, for our next fiscal year, starting October 1st, is going to be somewhere around 17 million quail. Uh, I will say that good, probably 40% stays in the southeast, and about, uh, from that, probably, yes, 70% stays in Georgia. From the time we, we uh, bring the eggs in, into the hatchery to the time they hatch, about 17 days of incubation. And then uh, we transport one day old baby birds to the um, uh, grow out houses. And they stay there for about 33 to 35 days. And, and it's amazing how, how fast they, they, they grow. About uh, five, six, uh, six years ago, when we started being inspected by the Georgia Department of Agriculture, meaning now we're more involved. The quails are processed um, under the uh, inspection of the, uh, the state of the state of Georgia in uh, general poultry guidelines. So we have, as the um, as the quail progresses into the uh, processing plant, we have various steps of control. They are called uh, CCPs, critical control points. It's been a, a great relationship in the last uh, in the last years. Uh, here with us uh, all the way from 7 a.m. in the morning, inspecting that the plant is in good condition to start our operations, all the way until uh, right after we finish to do things in the best way possible for the end user to get the right product in great uh, conditions at the best quality possible. Hi, my name is Dr. X Holt. I'm the director of meat inspection with the Georgia Department of Agriculture, and we supply the inspection that is performed on the quail at Quail International. Uh, in, in the normal guise of things, we provide a mandated inspection of meat type animals. There are certain animals that do not require mandated inspection, but for the reasons of, of having the product marketed in certain markets, then the, the customer would like to have it inspected by an inspecting authority, and that's what we do through multiple steps of the inspection for food safety and quality issues and at the end of that time then it is eligible to receive the Georgia Shield for inspection. We control in the uh, evisceration area, uh, pre-packing, um, and then uh, we have a, a, a very um, uh, strict temperature control all the way until we deliver to the uh, final customer. And, and all this to assure uh, not just quality, but also uh, food safety. Protein. And this, this small amount right here, about that, 15. Yes. So in this entire packet, you're getting 45 grams of protein. Not only you're getting the 45 grams of protein, but you're getting very low fat and very low cholesterol. Yeah, this is just the boneless uh, quail breast, so you don't have bones here to mess with. You can add your own recipes, can be chicken recipes. Uh, any poultry recipe will work great. Uh, uh, all of these three products, they're ready to go. Just thaw, put it on a grill, a fry pan. Uh, if you're going with the, the, the bacon also in the oven will work. And you're going to be ready in less than 10 minutes. You're going to have something fabulous. When you're buying from Plantation Quail, you're buying an all natural product on of top course, of that. on top okay. of that. And it's George Grown. And it's George Grown. <laughs> We're, we're looking forward to keep growing in Georgia and providing uh, good quail out there, all natural, of course, and to, for the people of the state and also for the people of the United States of America. Again, we're the, so far in Georgia, the largest quail processor in America. Uh, we've had a great visit with Quail International and been able to show how this uh, processor, uh, quail products in Georgia, is producing a real good Georgia grown product, but also how we help uh, ensure the food safety and the integrity of that, that product in the marketplace. And just another uh, contribution of our fine staff and what they do to help make Georgia strong. We just thank you for joining us today.